What's up guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to get six pack abs with the ab wheel. And I'm gonna tell you exactly what you guys have been doing wrong this whole time because not many of you know how to properly do this. And I'm telling you right now, this is first coming from me, that I'm gonna show you guys something that no one has ever done before with this. All right, so let's break it down step by step. When we're doing the ab wheel, the first thing we need to do is keep the knees together. What happens is when we separate our knees, as we're going out into the wheel, we're not really targeting our mid to lower core by our belly button. We're actually hitting the lower obliques. When you close off the knees, everyone, you now start to target the mid line of your lower abs. Now, when we go ahead and we take this approach, as we put the wheel down on the ground, I want you to treat your back almost like a upside down letter C. Or if you think about like a cat on Halloween, arching the spine right here, rather than inverting, if you invert, that's gonna to be too much pressure on your lower back and you're not really gonna be working your abs at all. So make sure that you arch your spine and as we roll out, as we go as far as you can, once you start to feel the lowest part of your spine, so once you feel your lumbar and sacrum dip, that is your cue to pull back in. And now that I'm right here, I'm a foot away from my knees, you don't wanna go all the way back in. You go all the way back in, you tend to sit back on the heels. When we do that, we loosen all the tension up in our core, so now it's we're not really building anything. So once we come all the way back, keep the knees and the wheel a foot apart and go back into your next rep. Once we come back here, stop, and then go right back in the next rep, come back in, all right? Now, for you beginners out there, if you guys are having trouble but you really wanna do this exercise, I recommend doing this. Get yourself up against the wall or any type of back, you know, you can use a, this table right here. So I'm gonna be right here, and I'm just gonna go a short distance, keep my knees together, and all I'm gonna do is just throw my hips forward, tap the edge, pull back, throw my hips forward, tap the edge. So I'm catching myself with the wheel here, and so now I can't go any further, but now I'm training my body to get used to this motion, but every time when we pull back, arch the spine back up, don't dip. So. Hopefully this helped you guys out in your journey of working with the ab wheel. I know a lot of you really want to use this or you might think it's a gimmick. I'm telling you right now, it's not a gimmick whatsoever. This is probably one of the best ways to build your ab strength known to mankind. So use this a lot and take my approach. Arch the spine. You extend all the way out till your lower back dips. Once you feel it start to dip, that's your time to pull back in. Stop the ab wheel a foot away from your knees. Don't let it touch the knees, because then if you sit back on the heels, you loosen up all that tension in your core, and we don't want that. Keep the tension, keep working on your core, and you guys will get that six pack abs. And thank you for watching another Tips and Tricks with the Ab Wheel. See you.